Unveiling the Mystery The Meaning of Sea of Fog Hello, dear friends and language enthusiasts. Today, we are going to embark on a fascinating journey to understand a rather picturesque English phrase, Sea of Fog. This expression is not only rich in imagery but also offers a beautiful example of how English can paint a picture with just a few words. So, let's dive in and explore the depths of this phrase together. When we look at the phrase, sea of fog, it is composed of two main elements. Sea, which most of us know as the large body of salt water that covers much of the Earth's surface, and fog, which is a thick cloud of tiny water droplets suspended in the atmosphere at or near the Earth's surface, limiting visibility. Now, imagine combining these two images. A sea of fog is a metaphorical expression used to describe a vast expanse of fog that is so dense and extensive that it resembles a sea. This is often experienced in nature when looking down from a height onto a landscape blanketed by heavy fog, where the fog stretches out like the water of a sea. Moving beyond the literal, the phrase, sea of fog, is often used in a figurative or poetic sense. In literature and speech, it can symbolize a situation or a state of mind where things are unclear, ambiguous, or confusing, much like how fog obscures one's vision. Writers may use it to describe a character's thoughts when they are indecisive or facing uncertainty. Or it might depict a scenario in literature where the way forward is not clear to the protagonists, representing their emotional or mental fogginess. Let's put sea of fog into context with some examples. After the rain, the valley was covered in a sea of fog, creating an almost mystical scene. His mind was a sea of fog after he received the unexpected news, unable to think clearly or make a decision. By using it in sentences, you can get a feel for how and when to use this phrase effectively in your own speech and writing. For English language learners, it's important to recognize that phrases like, sea of fog, are not to be taken literally in every context. They are part of a group of expressions known as figurative language which includes metaphors, similes, and idioms. Such phrases add depth and emotion to language. Remember, using these types of expressions can make your English sound more fluent and natural. They also show that you have a deeper understanding of the language and its nuances. I hope this exploration of the phrase, sea of fog, has clarified its meaning and how it can be used both literally and figuratively. English is a language full of such vivid expressions, and learning them can be both fun and enriching. May your language learning journey be as clear as a sunny day and not a sea of fog. Until our next lesson, keep practicing and stay curious.